What's wrong with saying bomb on an airplane? You can't say bomb on an airplane. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. I'm sorry, sir. You're going to have to check that. I got it. No, I'm sorry. That bag won't fit. We'll no, no, I'm not. Hey, I'm not checking my bag, OK? OK, there's no need to raise your voice, sir. I'm not raising my voice. This would be raising my voice to you, OK? I don't want to check my bag, OK? And by the way, your airline, you suck at checking bags, OK? Because I already did that once, and you lost it. And then I had everything screwed up very badly for me, OK? Uh, well, I can assure you that your bag will be placed safely below deck with the other luggage. Oh, yeah? How do you know my bag will be safe below with the other luggage? Huh? Are you physically going to take my bag and put it beneath the plane? Are you going to go right now outside with the guys with the earmuffs and go put it in there? No. No? OK. Then shut your pie hole and listen to me when I say that I am finished with the checking of the bags conversation. Sir, we have a policy on this airline that if a bag is this large, OK, you know what? Take Get your grubby little paws oh. off of my bag, OK? It's not like I have a bomb in here. It's not like I want to blow up the plane. Sir. I just want to stow my bag according to your safety regulations. Sir. Hey, hey sir. if you would take a second and take the little sticks out of your head, clean out your ears, and maybe you would see that I'm a person who has feelings, and all I have to do is do what I want to do, and all I want to do is hold on to my bag and not listen to you. Uh, and the only way that I would ever let go of my bag would be if you came over here right now and tried to pry it from my dead lifeless fingers, OK? If you can get it from my kung fu grip, then you can come and have it, OK? Otherwise, step off, bitch. <gasps> get off of me! Get off of me! Get off of me! Get off of me! Get I've got a plane full of people saying you threatened that stewardess. I was not threatening her. I was just trying to get my bag into the overhead storage thing. You were acting like a maniac, I... and you threatened her with a bomb. No, I said I didn't have a bomb. You said bomb. I said I, it's not like I have a bomb. You said bomb on an airplane. What's wrong with saying bomb on an airplane? You can't say bomb on an airplane. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bomb, 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 bomb. Bomb, 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 bomb. You gonna arrest me? You assaulted an airline employee. What if I was employee? in the military and I was a bombardier? Right there, bomb, 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 Take five, they got a specialist here. By Norm. Oh, shit. How did you get here? I'm everywhere, Fonker. I didn't do anything, Jack. Yeah, I know. Well, then tell these guys that I'm not a terrorist. Listen, Fonker, I'm not gonna tell anybody anything until you answer some questions. Unless you want to spend the next couple of years of your life in prison, you better goddamn well tell me the truth. No more lies, you understand? No more lies. Did you do this? Just answer the question. Did you have me taken off of that airplane? Just answer the question, put your hands over there. That's it. You're sick, you know that? Is your name Gaylord Fokker, yes or no? Yes. Are you a male nurse? Yes. Are you a pothead? No. Have you ever smoked pot? Yes. Did you spray paint the tail of a cat to pass him off as Mr. Jinx? Yes. And did you do that because you desperately were seeking my approval? Yes. Because you love my daughter, Pam? Yes. Do you want to marry her? Do you want to marry her? I did. Till I met you. What does that mean? I love your daughter, Jack. I love her more than anything. But frankly, sir, I'm a little terrified of being your son-in-law. This whole weekend has given me a lot of doubts about whether or not I could even survive in your family. I think you've got some serious issues. If I lighten up, would you consider marrying my daughter? Would you lighten up a lot? Yeah. Yes or no? Yes. Would you let me and Pam live our lives and not interfere all the time? I promise not to interfere in your lives all the time. Will you stop making fun of me for being a nurse? Could you at least try maybe to consider another profession? Jack, yes or no? Ever? No! OK, yes. Would you let me and Pam sleep in the same room? Don't push it, Fokker. You're in a real mess. If you married my daughter, would you support her in the way that she deserves to be supported? Yes. Would you be honest and faithful to her? Yes. Will you devote yourself entirely to her for the rest of your life? Of course. Gaylord Falker, will you 
be my son-in-law? Thank you.